y'all. So today we're going to be reviewing this wig here. Um, this is the Empress Lace Lace Front Edge Wig. Um, Tuscany by Ebony Line. So, well, from Ebony Line. The wig is by Sensational. Um, so Ebony Line sent me this wig. And, um, in the video you all saw me, um, try to pluck it and get it together. So, being that there's not much lace on here, um, there's really not a need for you to try to pluck it and try to, um, thin out the hairline. You can, however, thin out your baby hairs as well as try to thin out this part. I'm going to try to thin out the part, but... I think it was too much of a hassle band. This is very curly hair and it's synthetic. It was just tangling, so I just stopped. Um, I did put some foundation and some powder in my parting area. And I did, like, create some little baby hairs just to make it look a little natural. So, this is the hair about, I'm going to say, yeah, two days after the initial video. And this is what it's giving. I think I'm going to go ahead and cut it. I'm going to pull it out to the front so you all can see where it stops on me. So, it comes really, and it's, that's not even all of it. Let me see. It's really, really long. So, um, and this is a lot of hair. If you're not into the va va voomish hair, this is not for you. But this hair is really long. So, what I'm about to do is I'm just going to cut just a little bit off just to um have it frame my face a little more and just to cut off some of the length This side just took back behind my ear with just a little piece just hanging. Whew. So now I'm about to just go in and cut some of this length just because it's long. Okay, so I'm going to split it down the middle. And I just want it to be right around, I guess, where my nipple stops. So I'm just going to um, cut it from right there. And this is how much hair I cut. And then we can do the same thing to the other side. see if I can do this on camera so you all can see and oh yeah that's how much hair I took off so now the hair is at a pretty doable length and it's still va la Um, This is a pretty wig. Especially if you want to try out the big curly hair. And not spend all your coin. You know, to begin with. Um, this is very pretty. Um, the I showed you all the lace. It's not really, you can't do too much. I think you can turn it into a middle part. But you all know how I feel about middle parts. But overall, this hair is pretty. Um... It's gorgeous. It's probably going to be like a go-to wig of mine like for work when I don't feel like doing my hair. I can just throw this on because this, this what I have on now is not tacked down. I use the comb in the back and the comb that's on the side and then I just um, put got to be on my, on my little edges, my baby hairs and that is it. I really do love this hair now that I cut it. Like, it's not so much. 
and it's still giving me life. I did wear this hair in my baby in my um one of my maternity shoots. I will make sure to insert a picture. Um, I had not cut it then, but I wish I had a. But you know, it is what it is. But yeah, y'all. Um, please go check out this wig. I will leave all the information in the description bar below. Again, this is the Tuscany in the color 1B. Um, it's a natural curve parts, 100% human premium fiber. Um, and I picked this up from Ebony Line. Uh, well, Ebony Line sent this to me. I didn't pick it up. Ebony Line sent this to me to review it. And here we go.